Hello all Dan Safarians and Dinosaurs. Today we will take a look at plenty of new animal figures, okay? We have some prehistoric animals right here, such as the saber-toothed cat. This is actually an extinct big cat. And speaking of big cats, we have plenty of other big cats figures right over here. And this one is actually a Florida panther right over here. It looks really beautiful and majestic. And right here, we have a prehistoric animal by the name of Deodon. This is actually a prehistoric pig. I'm not kidding you, a prehistoric pig. And right here, I have one of my most favorite um, prehistoric, I mean not prehistoric animals, but one of my most favorite big cats, which is um, the white tiger. All right, I'm gonna place it right over here. Next up, what do we have here? We have a jaguar. All right, which is another big cat. Looks really beautiful. Next up, take a look at this. We have a prehistoric reptile right over here, which is known as a postosuchus. It reminds me of a modern day um, crocodile. And speaking of modern day versus prehistoric days, right over here, we have a prehistoric elephant. This is known as the woolly mammoth, which is a you know, a prehistoric elephant covered with fur. And do you guys know that recently, um, a prehistoric um, baby woolly mammoth was actually discovered. Um, such, I mean, it was actually like a woolly rhino as well. Um, yeah, and check this out. This definitely looks like a prehistoric animal as well. We have an iguana, a modern day animal, but of course, it was very closely related to, you know, like dinosaurs and stuff like that. Um, we have a prehistoric reptile right over here, which is known as a um, Elasmosaurus. Okay, just gonna place it right over here. We have a horse, a beautiful, majestic looking horse. More big cats over here. Cheetah, is this a cheetah or a leopard? I think this should be a cheetah, looking at the body shape, really slender and slim, and they can run really, really fast. A prehistoric marine reptile, which is known as a Mosasaurus. It is actually my most favorite um, um, prehistoric animal. Yep. And this sea creature right here actually looks like a prehistoric alien to me. It is actually a frog fish. And it has a um it has an ability to camouflage itself really well. Okay, you're gonna place it right over here. Another prehistoric um, marine reptile, which is known as a Mosasaurus. Do you guys like my new latest dance surprise? Um, you know, neon like right at the back. I think it looks really cool. It can actually make um, um, the en entire video more interesting. Okay, we have a hippopotamus right over here. Okay, next up, we have a koala. All right, another beautiful big cat. This is. Um, it should be a Bengal tiger. So right at the back, a very very cool dolphin, which is known as a Atlantic white-sided dolphin. Right over here, we have a beautiful lizard, which is known as a collared lizard. Okay, it has the ability to camouflage itself really well, as well. Okay. Basking shark with the mouth wide open to take in all the water and filter out all the food particles. We have a reef squid right here. You can see it looks really, really beautiful. I really love the material of this. Really shiny and there's plenty of tentacles. Now, if you take a look at the tentacles, you can see many suction carps. All right. And another prehistoric animal, which is known as a Prestosuchus. Another prehistoric reptile. It looks like a um, crocodile to me as well. And right here, we have a alligator, a modern day alligator. And this is actually a white alligator. And you can see there are some resemblance to them. Mm -hmm. Next up, we have a giant anteater. All right, it has a very long nose or very long face. Jellyfish, it can be extremely um, poisonous. All right, another prehistoric animal right over here, which is known as a sacosuchus. 
It is. It really looks like a modern day crocodile. Another big cat, and I'm not too sure what type of big cat this is. So if you guys know, please let me know down below. A beautiful snake right here, and this is known as a sidewinder rattlesnake. Okay, next up we have a gigantic big hippo right over here. So hippos, they are extremely aggressive animals to be honest with you. They have actually attacked more humans than um, um, the lion in Africa. We have a beautiful cave bear right over here, okay. Yep, this is a prehistoric bear. A killer whale which is known as an orcar. And a beautiful red crab, as you guys can see, it is really really um, colourful, it has huge pencils and there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, or I mean it has like 10, 10 legs, of course if you count in the pencils as well. Okay. It is known as a Sally Light Food Crab. Beautiful crab. We have a sperm whale right over here, one of the largest um, living thing that you can ever find. Okay, it is a mammal. A peacock with the beautiful feathers opened really wide to like intimidate um, you know the predators to scare off people as well. Ostrich, they can run really fast, but they are a type of flightless bird, they can't fly. Okay. What else we've got? Yeah, we've got this new figure. This is actually a um, white brock tail and I think the antlers actually fall off every winter and they will just grow back again after winter. So really interesting animal. A huge um, right wheel, so you can see plenty of little bumps across the entire body. Looks really cool. An elephant. Extremely strong and big animals, the trunk are able to like lift up logs, so they're extremely, extremely powerful. And here we have a beautiful Sumatran rhino, if I'm not wrong. Yes, that's right. This is not um it's not actually a um African rhino, so you can see a bit of difference to it. The colors are also different. We have a Baquita, which this is critically endangered. There are less than 10 left in the world. A great white shark right over here. And this is actually a say whale. So if you take a look at the facts, the say whale consumes on average about a ton of food per day. Yeah, so 1,000 kilograms of food per day. This is a whale shark, beautiful. Leatherback sea turtle, this um, figure we have just purchased not too long ago. Yep, just like last week. I'll be getting more sea animals coming in really soon, so stay tuned for that. We have a lion right here. A beluga whale. This portion, this really really protruding um, portion of his head is actually soft and really puffy. We have a long horn bull. Check this out. Yeah, that's right. You know, the, the horns are really long. I'm pretty sure this can be used as a very good defensive weapon against um, you know, any predators. Okay, check this out. An orangutan, extremely intelligent. They're pretty docile and they are quite um, sympathetic. They can actually feel for humans. They will try to save humans as well. Yep, I've seen a video where one orangutan was trying to pull a man out from the mud. And um, this is a hammerhead shark. This is a prehistoric fish known as a seal or um, seal of can. That's right. And this it's a bow head whale. Alright. So yes, these are some of the sea animals and prehistoric animals that you can find today. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know whether you want me to make more prehistoric animals video. I'll be super happy to do it, okay? Thanks for watching this and I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.